Mike. All right. All right. Uh, Yeezy and his wife Kim spent the weekend partying with other celebrities. Yeah, uh, for a wedding and now making headlines for his choice of footwear at said wedding. Ashley Williams joins us live this morning from the Fox and Ghosts in Sacramento. You're spilling the tea. What's up, y'all? What's going on? So it is time for some tea. I'm ready. Are yes. you ready? What's ready. the tea, girl? It. We're going to start with Kanye West. So we all know Kanye West loves to step outside of the box, right, sure. when it comes to his fashion. But what in all the yays is going on here? Yeah. Take a look at this. <laughs> Over the weekend, the rapper and his boo thing, Kim Kardashian, attended the nuptials of two chains and his longtime love, Keisha two Ward. Chains. But the pair turned heads when not only did Kim show up in this bright neon green latex I mean. dress, but Yeezy then decided to rock this Louis Vuitton suit paired with, drum roll please, these Yeezy slides. Oh my gosh, thank you. The shoes were way now too small. Now listen. Half of his <laughs> heel was hanging off the back. Oh, now not only did it not fit, but he had the nerve to wear this to a wedding, you guys, to a wedding. Needless to say, folks could not stop talking about them. One Twitter user wrote, Kanye West slides he wore with Kim and that neon dress look like the same slides my mama wears for ankle problems. I'm done with him. We are yeah. all done with him. It's also worth noting the shoes, listen to this, retail for maybe another drum roll. Okay. They retail for a whopping $160. Those shoes, $160. That's so ridiculous. Now, can they fit if I'm going to pay that much? Can they fit? No. I don't get it. So, but let's get back to the wedding, which, okay. by the way, was beautiful. The birthday song rapper exchanged vows with Ward at the hotel Villa Casa Casarina, otherwise known as the Versace Aww. Mansion in Miami. I Why know, is she so wearing sweet. sunglasses? Okay, so Why is she wearing those sunglasses? But, <laughs> you're so cute. Okay, so on to another rapper, Nicki Minaj. She just went off on this crazy rant over not topping Billboard's charts. Listen to oh. this. As you know, the female MC dropped her latest album, Queen, earlier this month, which I listened to. It was not great. But unfortunately, <laughs> she did not soar like she thought. Instead, Travis Scott's Astro World topped her on the charts. And according to Nikki, it's all thanks to Kylie Jenner. She tweeted, I put my blood, sweat, and tears into writing a dope album only for Travis Scott to have Kylie Jenner post a tour pass telling people to come see her and Stormy. LOL, I'm actually laughing. Listen, Nikki, girl, if the album were actually decent, oh, quite oh. possibly you would have beat out Travis Scott. Ooh, I'm going to leave it right there. Wow. The cool thing is, Nicki Minaj and Travis Scott are both performing during tonight's MTV VMAs. Here's what the else VMAs. you get to look forward to. Jennifer Lopez is being honored yes. with the Michael Jackson Video Van Gogh Award. We are, of course, all dying to know what exactly she will be wearing. Courtney Dempsey, I know, will have all the fashion you know we will, locked and loaded tomorrow morning. Yeah, okay, I so the show wait. is going to be hosted by Kevin Hart, Tiffany Haddish, and Blake Lively. So you know it's going to be a good time. Yes. Uh, those slides, I'm going to go buy some. Can you get the right size, though? Work. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying, if you get the right yes. size, I might be able to give it a pass. No, I'm purposely going to get three sizes too small. Yeah. Just, oh, my yeah. goodness. Right. That's the way you're supposed to wear them. Ooh, I'm yeah. out of breath. Kanye takes me out, y'all. Yeah, right. That right? Was, he just that makes you tired. <laughs> that was your tea. All right. the that was good tea. tea. Good tea. That was good, good tea. tea. Spill the tea and Thank sharing Dad. some tough love at the same time. Yes. It is actually <laughs>